put the pedal to the metal end. Yeah, lead foot. Let's go. Pedal to the metal. Here we go. After years in the planning, zoo nutritionist Michelle is conducting a zoo-wide trial, taste testing her new food pellets designed right here at Taronga. Come right up to clean it up. Always oh, gonna give it a sniff. Yeah. Okay. She got a big tick of approval from the gorillas. Now she's hoping to repeat that with another, much smaller and much pickier primate, the lemurs. Let's just lay it down. <laughs> Prosimians are not great with new things, and so I'm really, I don't know, <laughs> I, it's going to be a 50-50 chance yeah. whether this works today or not, but let's see how they go. So if they don't go after the pellet, what are we going to do? Notoriously fussy eaters, the lemurs will be getting some additional food to help entice them to try the pellet. Just to help with the process, I've actually made up some sweet potato and corn puree. That's something that they love, and so combining it with the pellets could actually encourage them to eat it. We're going to try pellets on their own and also a little bit with the puree, and we'll see what the outcome is. Is we can start to add a little bit of pellets in. Sniffing, sniffing, yeah, sniffing. Yeah, so we'll see a lot of smelling. Sniffing, sniffing. Lots of sniffing going on. Haven't seen it trying yet. Oh, I haven't. Come on, Salada. Yeah, I know. So you can see there's an interest, but, um, but I don't think they're too sold. While it looks like the first big snub for the trial, Michelle hasn't given up yet and it's time to bring out the big guns. If we sweet have, potato and corn. Let's see if this sweet potato and corn can convince them a little bit. Yep. So, oh. Michelle, this is really promising. This is Dia and Toki, the two boys that joined our group this year from Dubbo. But they look like they're enjoying it too. How's that? I mean, I'm going to say that's a win. That is a win. <laughs> That's, That's a big, big win. Do you want to do a cake trial? I think we have to do a cake <laughs> trial. These choosy primates like to hold their food as they eat it. Here's the new cake, and it's a little bit different. Yes. So Michelle also prepped some special pellet cakes to try to win them over that way. So we've got bamboo up there now. Okay. Again, there. Oh, I'm going to say that's a no from bamboo, but now we've okay. got salata. Salata. So, Salata, no luck with Salata. Toki, <laughs> our youngest, he's the most inquisitive. We're still not having a lot of success there. A couple of the members of the group weren't that interested. We saw Bamboo and Toki not really take to it. With Andriva. So let's see what happens. Oh, that's the new cake. That's okay. the new cake went first. I have, I'm not even writing this down. I'm so excited. <laughs> The older members of the group taking the cake, Andriba and McKilly, that's really positive. So I think with Andriba having the, at least going for the new one first, that was good. The cake has those extra omegas in it, which is fantastic for their fur, it's fantastic for their teeth, it's fantastic for their skin. And for our older animals, they just need that little bit of extra supplementation in the diet to support them. So the fact that they are taking the new cake for me, is the best. And the younger ones we can work on. Oh, oh, oh. Michelle, that's awesome. Oh. That's really oh exciting. God, that's so nice to see. Look. We're going to have to gradually introduce these pellets into their diet and into the cake as well. But it's definitely something that they accepted more readily than we, we could have expected. So we're, it won't be a difficult thing to add to their diet. I'm very happy about it.